Hey guys, in today's video I'll be talking about how to retouch a sport photography image so just trying to make it have more clarity and just make it I don't want to say pop but yeah make it pop let's go so this is going to be a really simple tutorial if you want me to go deeper into the retouching of images let me know in the comments but this is just going to be starting off um, simple retouch of an image what we're going to be using for this is camera raw filters um, and it's nothing nothing complex at all it's just going to be tweaking a few things and then we'll see we'll show what the actual result is in the end so obviously I've got a picture here of Jota just got it off the Liverpool website um, I would always duplicate the background layer because obviously then you can go back if you do it wrong. So I just undo that and then Command J if you're on Mac. Um, filter, camera or filter. So obviously there's a lot of things here if you're not um, familiar with camera or filters. Um, it can be a little daunting with all the, the sort of things on the side here. but. All I'm going to go with today is basic and maybe a little detail. So start off just explaining what they do. Um, exposure will bring things very bright and just make it really white, basically. Um, we'll be using that in a minute. Contrast obviously brings out the blacks. Highlights, pretty much the same as exposure, just a little less. Shadows. Brings out shadows, whites, you can, so you can dim the whites, really amplify the whites, and then the same with black. Texture and clarity will bring out all the fine sort of lines within your image, so obviously that's a lot, but um, and then obviously you can go the complete opposite way and it'll smooth it out. Vibrance and saturation just brings out the colours, just makes it um, sort of redder. Uh, so what I'll start off with on this is I always usually go with highlights first, so I like to dim the highlights just to bring out, see like around his eyes, it's just bringing out the details a little bit more. Um, yes, yeah, so quite like about there. And obviously you just play around, you don't have to copy my settings, it'll be different for every photo. Um, so then shadows will go high up just to bring it out a bit so yeah obviously you see it's just bringing up the shadows a little bit whites I'm gonna knock that down a bit and then blacks will bring it up, down slightly yeah and then the main thing with this is um, texture and clarity so I'll up the clarity quite not too much, but quite a bit. And then texture will just round it off a little bit. So you can see, even in the background here, it's, um, the textures come up quite a bit and it and it makes the actual player, I don't know, his, his face just looks so much more in detail now that we've just upped those two things. So you can, you can literally see his freckles on his face. Um, so if we zoom out, and this is probably all all I would do. Um, maybe we'll up the saturation just a tiny bit, but obviously with the kit, it's a bit awkward. The vibrance up a bit. Yeah, and I would say that's that's probably it. So obviously this is what we started with, and this is what we finished with. So just hit OK. And obviously we've got our layer here that we've made the changes on, and this is the original. So if you just turn the eye off, we'll see what this is before, and this is after. And it's a huge difference and it literally only takes a few minutes um you could create it into a preset but obviously like i said before every image is different and sometimes you'll need to turn up things a little more than normal or turn them down a little more than normal so i usually just like to do it by eye but yeah this is just a quick easy way on how to retouch your sport photography um let me know in the comments if you'd like more of this sort of stuff um obviously i do a lot of design tutorials and stuff but this is a little bit more into photography and making your images look the best that they can be so yeah thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video bye